fishing action has been fantastic. On the first day, we had one team, father and son combination, tagged and released four blue marlin. And any time you can tag and release four blue marlin in a day, anywhere in the world the blue marlin are caught, it's a fantastic day. The tournament has been bringing great things to Kona for 60 years. I mean, essentially, the job of this tournament was to make the world aware that this great fishery existed. So that's why the tournament was created by Peter Fithian back in 1959. Peter Fithian, with the help of charter boat captains at the time, and also people in the Hawaii Visitors Bureau and others that recognized the value of tourism. Uh, Peter had come from the Masters, so he, he had come from a tournament that was world famous and he saw all these great fish coming in and being weighed in, in the lawn in front of the Kona Inn. And as a result of that, he said, we should be able to bring international teams here and put this place on the map. And that's what this tournament has done over the years. So there's 12 teams from Australia, there are six teams from New Zealand, there are eight teams from Japan, and then there are teams from many other places, Papua New Guinea, the Republic of Palau, um, New Caledonia. And um, the other thing that I was fascinated by is that every Australian state is represented in this tournament for the first time in history. The Aussies have been coming from year one, but this year every state in Australia sent at least one team, even Tasmania. <laughs> Having 40 teams for the 60th is huge. It's, it's the number that we wanted. It's actually the highest number that could be accommodated with the available charter boats for the tournament this year. So the 60th is special just because we made it. Um, it also displays everything that this event has brought to this town. More tourists, recognition of the sport fishery. Kona is known as the, the best place in the world to catch Pacific blue marlin. And also, this tournament premiered science, citizen science, by anglers on the water during the day. So all of these fish that are tagged and released are all contributing to science. The minimum weight that can be weighed in the tournament is a 300 pound fish. So this fish will be close to the minimum, but every pound over 300 produces additional points for the team. So it's very valuable at this point in the tournament to have a fish of this size and to get those extra points.